so the latest firmware of mayhem is out which is 2.0.1 so we are going to see how we can update this firmware using hackrf.app uh, so it's a web url uh, through which you can directly update your firmware so first we will update the firmware and then we will see what are the new features in this firmware so let me connect my uh, hackrf1 with uh, my laptop connected and over here you can see the firmware version is 2.0.0 so let's just update the firmware so we have to click on connect device and over here you can see a USB serial device COM4 and it's paired so let's just connect and it might take few seconds to connect so it's connected over here you can see and over here you can see firmware version is uh, 2.0.0 so we have to click on manage firmware and update to latest stable release so we will click on stable release and it will download the firmware so now you don't need to take out your SD card and all those things which we used to do before. So it will just download the firmware in the utilities and then you can directly update the firmware. Over here you can see the firmware is updating. And now the firmware is updated to 2.0.1 so let's just see what are the new features in this firmware so over here you can see the first thing is uh, this fox hunt app at the last you can see this is something new uh, so the fox hunt app is designed to help you with the fox hunt game where you need to find transmitters so you need to have uh, directional antennas and you can find uh, different transmitters using this app and you also need uh, uh, gps uh, external gps as well so this is a uh, fox hunt app which is new and then there is another thing which is uh, new uh, uh, which is in uh, utilities so uh, over here in utilities there is there is word drive map so if you have any captured uh, files that has geo tags this app will show you those in a map uh, and for this app you also need external GPS right so we will see those things uh, later in uh, later uh, in our later videos and then there is another thing which is new uh, and you have to go in settings and over here you can see auto start so we can select any app like for example looking glass and we can save and then we can restart and it will directly start the looking glass app so any app which you have selected in auto start uh, will start when you uh, start your uh, port pack so this is uh, something new so these are few things which i have noticed till now in uh, 2.0.1 firmware which are new in our later videos we are going to further uh, explore all the things which are new in 2.0.1 firmware Thank you.